So in today's video, I'm going to give you an overview of Fusion Builder Live, which is just the front end builder that comes with uh, the Avada theme. And I'm going to show you sort of how it works, the ins and outs, when to use it, what it's good for, and really just give you the basics so that if you're thinking about using Avada as your theme, or you're already using Avada and you haven't even touched the live builder yet, that you have an understanding of how it works. So this is a website that's built on WordPress using the Avada theme. And you'll see up here, there's the Avada option. And then right next to that, which this is just all the global options and different stuff. But right next to that, you'll see this live builder button here. So if you click on that, viewing any page, it's going to allow you to live edit that specific page. And this builder, it's uh, what you see is what you get. Builder, a WYSIWYG. Basically, it's just a drag and drop builder, right? So now that we're looking at this page through the front end Fusion Builder Live, we start to see some different options, like we can click to edit this container. But what I like to use this for is editing content specifically. That's just personal preference. I've been building with Avada for a long time, and so I tend to like to use this backend builder because I've just been using it forever. But one thing I've started using the front end builder for a lot is editing content. So with the back end builder, if I want to edit this content, I've got to figure out which section it is, click in here. This is all highlight. This is all white, so I have to go to text view, edit it, then save it, then refresh the page to see what it looks like. It's kind of a whole process. But from here, I could literally just highlight and delete that whole sentence and see what it looks like and then if I don't want to delete it I can hit command Z and so it really it gives you a lot of functionality from the front end to be able to edit what you're already seeing and same thing with moving sections around so say I want to move this block oops not the button I want to move the whole block say I want to switch these around I can really easily drag and drop these different containers into different places on the front end of the site. Or maybe I want to move this button and I want it to be right here. <laughs> that looks terrible, <laughs> but you get the idea. The advantage to using the live builder is that you can edit what you're already seeing. And then once you're done editing the page, then all you do is click save. It's going to go ahead and save those changes that you implemented. And then when you click this exit button here in the top right, you can choose to exit to the front end and or to the back end, whichever. It doesn't really matter. But then you can look at the page, make sure everything looks good, and then go ahead and take it live from there. So again, it's pretty easy to use. All you have to do is go to the page you want to edit, click the live builder, it's going to pop up where you can then start editing that page directly from where you're viewing that page, which has, again, its advantages and disadvantages. It's a little bit more difficult to get into the real depths of things, I find. Um, but it, maybe if you started using it from the very beginning of learning Avada, you know, you might feel differently about that. So I hope that was helpful. If there was anything that you have questions about, feel free to drop them down in the comments below. I'll be sure to get to them there. And until next time, take care.